is just in. August is hotter than ever at Appalachian Wireless as they are slashing all normal contract pricing on all smartphones by 50% when you sign up for service. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. While driving in downtown Pikeville, you may notice a few changes to the historic York House. Construction crews are now in the final stages of completing the project. It's preserving part of our history and part of our culture and part of our heritage. I think that speaks volumes about the, the type of people that we are here that we're interested in making sure that, that while we grow, uh, we're still preserving our history and our culture. It's been an ambitious project and one that the Commission was glad to take on and so far we've been able to do it under time and, and under budget. In April, EKB News last spoke to the Pikeville City Commission about the project. However, since then, more work has been underway. We're doing a lot of the uh, grading work and then getting it ready for uh, seed and straw and grass to grow on it. And then also recently, we just the drywall and plaster was completed on the inside of the house. And we um, just opened bids for another bid package that'll do a lot of the flooring work, plumbing, a lot of those little finishing touches on the inside, get the walls painted. And Once the project is complete, big plans are in store for the historic York House. It will be a, an arts and cultural center. Of course, in January of 2017, the Commission's partnered with the University to bring an archaeological exhibit here from the Middle East. And I've seen some of the artifacts that are going to be here, and that is just going to be spectacular. And Pikeville will be its last stop before it heads back to Israel. While no tentative date has been set for the opening of the historic York House, a projected date has been set for October. Reporting in downtown Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.